Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh uh, My name is Muhammad Zamru Zainal Thanks for watching my videos And this time uh, In these videos I will show you uh, This one of the common problem When you working with GAP Because GAP uh, comprises of uh, uh, Files that are associated with wells And also as with tank When you move uh, uh, gap files or you move the component files uh, like Prosper and Ember to a uh, different folders and from uh, hard drive to memory stick sometimes gap tend to, for, uh, to forget those uh, locations so th this is a, a common problem like I said when, when you keep on moving those, those files so the the, uh, the easiest way is uh, if you are being prompt with this uh, problem, with this uh, error message, get a de detected invalid file path. Click. You want to edit it now? Yes. Click yes. And see, there are two locations the, uh, of your sub uh, uh, component files: the embal tank file, uh, tank embal uh, tank files, as well as uh, prosper well files. Okay, first let me let me specify where is the location of those files. So, embal is in my embal folder. Now it turned green, then it's good. So the rest of the file, which is the uh, prosper dot out, prosper dot vlp. So I just point it to the appropriate prosper file so now you are good or oh, the second option is you have to repeat all over again you have to go here specify the location of the prosper file and then do repeat those steps uh, with this uh, tank okay then it is quite tedious so the, the 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 first method is more preferable okay um one way of uh, to avoid that uh, unnecessary uh, problem is to keep everything in the same folder maybe it's, it's not really a right way to organize it but if you can manage it make sure everything is in the same folder so that whenever you transfer those files those uh, gap files you will have to grab the whole folder everything Mo uh, other it's, it's not only limited to embal file and prosper file but all other files associated for example like the vlp files and this is a, a, a results file so all the plots are kept in this uh, weird extensions so just keep keep everything in the same folder okay at the same time you might want to use the uh, gap uh, archive options for example like if you already done uh, completed if you are this uh, especially if you already completed uh, with the with get folder and now you you want to make uh, to zip it, to zip these files more or less to zip it in such a way that it's more convenient for you to carry it so you you, you I, I would recommend you to use the archive file function in get so how to do that so go to file and archive so this is where get will create these are two options to create and to extract to create is basically to to zip all the files associated with this particular get model so that you can be sure whenever you move these files into other location you it's just a matter of to unzip it or to extract it so let's see how to do it okay I will place it at the same location as the original files. Okay. Okay, how to, to zip the file? Okay, first you go to files 
archive create so I just keep it under the same name block J block I and the file extension will be dot G A R okay then I will save it so as you can see here everything will be associate, associated with this particular get file will be added and at the same time if there is a, uh, if there is an additional file for example like a word file or excel file that you want to include into this uh, zip uh, gap zip file so you can add them okay as a as a baggage okay it's being selected so i'm, I'm just focusing on the uh, on prosper and embal and all the file associated to M, uh, gap so i just click right success so when i go to this file So here, I think. so when I go to the second uh, to the file that I just created, so these are the, the zip files. Okay. Now I can just copy and move it to somewhere else. Maybe I can put it in a different folder. There. And then to unzip it, I, I just have to double click. Again, um, it will ask, uh, prompt me on the location on where is the, the directory for me to extract all those files and I'm more or less happy with it so I just extract it so it will prompt me to open the get files voila so now uh, this new get file is, is uh, safely being moved to other locations so after after this, if I want to transfer the uh, get file, I will just grab the G, uh, the extension GAR get archive rather than uh, I grab the, the individual files and with a chance of uh, with uh, that might have a problem with those uh, missing uh, path as as, uh, as, you, as you can see. Okay, that's all for today. So I hope you enjoy these videos and. Thank you very much. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.